Hey everyone, just want to review here Dr. Prager's or Dr. Prager's spinach littles. I found these at Whole Foods a few weeks ago. They're in the freezer section and I cooked them up tonight for the first time. I was really curious about what they would taste like um, and I'll dive into the nutritional value in a minute. But they are, they are non-GMO. They're not organic, so that means that they still can be very highly sprayed with chemicals, but at least they're non-GMO. I'll talk about non-GMO and GMO products or crops in a different video. Um, but they are soy free. They are also certified gluten free for those of you with gluten sensitivities or celiac disease. They are dairy free, however they do have eggs. They do contain egg whites. So the first four ingredients are spinach, potatoes, onions, and potato flakes. So you would think they would be great in nutritional value and taste great. Well, I fried them up on the skillet. I used avocado oil. I fried them for about 10 minutes, just flipped them. Um, they tasted great. I give them an A for taste. You'll see what my kids thought of them in the next video. But with regards to nutritional value, I'm not, I'm gonna be honest, I'm not gonna lie. I actually, they, they kind of disappointed me. I rate them a C. I mean, they're definitely better than, you know, Cheetos or McDonald's or junk food, but I think uh, most of us would be able to make on our own, you know, some mashed potato and spinach fritters that would be a better nutritional value. Two main reasons, fiber content is extremely low and it uses canola oil. I'll dive into the fiber um, information and canola issues in other videos, but really quickly for those of you who may be shopping right now, fiber is way too low, only one gram per serving. Our kids need at least 20 grams a day. Us adults need at least like 30 grams a day. So too low, one gram is way too low. And canola oil, super pro-inflammatory. Run away from anything that says canola oil in it in the ingredients, even if it's organic very pro-inflammatory um, and highly linked, especially if it's genetically modified, which this one isn't, but highly linked with a lot of health conditions like liver disease, kidney issues, hypertension, and stroke. Talk more about that later, but overall, A for taste, but C for nutritional quality. All right, thanks guys. All right, let's try these spinach littles. Show everyone the shape. Uh, the yes, what is that? What's that shape? Stegosaurus, upside down. <laughs> All right, go ahead and try it. Let us know what you think. This is a stegosaurus. All right, go ahead. Go ahead and try it. You don't have to lie. I could tell by your face. What do you think? Do you like it? Um, you do? You don't seem like you do. Okay, so second time was better. What do you think, little man? Back. Oh, he went back. It's a good sign. More? All right, he wants more. 